Good day. My name is Thomas van Hasten and I work on the South African team of the Tobacco Control Data Initiative, or TCDI, which is led by Development Gateway in partnership with the Research Unit on the Economics of Excisable Products and funded by the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation. Good day. My name is Kirsten van der Zee and I'm also working on the TCDI project. I'm a research officer from the Research Unit on the Economics of Excisable Products based at the University of Cape Town. In partnership with REAP, the four-year TCDI works to address barriers to data use in tobacco control by consolidating available and trusted data, identifying and filling data gaps, and creating an online resource for policymakers to access the relevant data needed to pass and monitor tobacco control legislation. The initiative has been run in six countries, which are the Democratic Republic of Congo, Ethiopia, Kenya, Nigeria, South Africa, and Zambia. All countries have their own websites, which can be accessed through the TCDI landing page seen on screen. The South African TCDI website provides an interactive portal that collects, analyzes, and presents data and information on tobacco control in South Africa through rigorous research. The website provides information on several themes, which include prevalence, illicit trade, health, policies, e-cigarettes, and agriculture. The website and themes with further information can be accessed through the link on screen. In 2022, TCDI conducted a national telephone survey of e-cigarette users in South Africa. The survey was designed to be representative of adults living in urban areas. We interviewed over 21,000 people about their use of e-cigarettes and standard cigarettes. The main aims of the survey were to determine what proportion of South African adults used e-cigarettes and to understand the relationship between the use of e-cigarettes and regular cigarettes. The data from the survey is available for download on the TCDI website. We have also developed a user manual which is available on the site. This document outlines the data collection process that was followed as well as guiding users through the use of the data. The survey questionnaire is also available for download from the site. Some of the key findings from the survey are shown on the South African TCDI website's e-cigarette page. These findings include the fact that more than 1 in 10 South Africans have ever tried an e-cigarette, 4% of South Africans currently use e-cigarettes, and e-cigarette prevalence was significantly higher amongst males than females, and also significantly higher amongst the younger age groups. Besides the e-cigarette survey, another crucial fact shown on this page is that the South African Treasury will introduce an excise tax on e-cigarettes of 2 rand 90 per milliliter from June 2023. This webpage includes further information on e-cigarettes in South Africa and includes modules such as e-cigarette prevalence in South Africa, information about e-cigarette policy, and the relation between e-cigarettes and youth, amongst others. The webpage with further information can be accessed via the link on screen. By providing detailed and accurate data to support policymakers in their fight to reduce tobacco consumption, we can improve the livelihoods of all South Africans and reduce tobacco's substantial economic and health burden on the country. Thank you very much.